Buongiorno and welcome to amazing Tuscany. I am Wilco Kleine and yeah, very nice to that you watch another vlog of, about my traveling life in MotoGP. Uh, so today is Wednesday and uh, I started this morning at 4 a.m. to go to Schiphol and then yeah, of course to Florence and then uh, yeah, uh, to this beautiful place. Um, the pit box was pretty much set already. So uh, yeah, for me an easy day, uh, just clean the rims to be ready for tomorrow morning and uh, yeah, it's I think 6 o'clock now, so we went back to the hotel, I mean, look at that, this amazing place and um, I had a shower and at 7.15 we go back to the track to eat in our hospitality and then uh, yeah, tomorrow we do uh, the weekend again, uh, so but for now let me show you this amazing place, it's, it's really awesome, so uh, go on. Thursday morning that means again of course the rims to Michelin and as you can see I put them there we're the first so uh, now uh, I'm off to the breakfast we don't have breakfast in our hotel or our house so we have breakfast here in the hospitality So I got the message from Michelin, mine are done, also Marquez's are done, let's check the app, yeah, so all my tires are done, 3 and 3, that's the wet, 6 and 6 is the dry, and Alex fit 7 front, 9 rear. Okay, so they're done, uh, let's pick them up and uh, yeah, let's prepare the tires, put them in the tire warmers and all that stuff.
So everything is packed and um, I took a shower and as you can see now I'm uh, uh, busy with my second job and <laughs> that's driving the truck. So um, yeah, a little over thousand kilometer to go to Barcelona because that's a back to back race this time. And it's just a little bit busy here to get on to the highway. Actually, it was not so bad going away from Mugello. Uh, also, I think because spectators was not so high this time. I don't know why, but uh, there weren't that many spectators this time. And uh, but yeah, for me now it's okay because yeah, I can get easily on the highway and uh, go to Barcelona. So uh, yeah, I had a little shower and um, I. Uh, I think I have a sandwich for <laughs> for dinner, <laughs> and then uh, yeah, we try to make uh, around 330 kilometers today. Then sleep for the night, and then tomorrow should be uh, possible to reach uh, the Circuit de Catalunya. And uh, we're we're not parking until Wednesday because hospitalities need a little bit more time to to get well, at least to to break everything down and also set up again so and they have to drive there so we don't park until Wednesday and then um, I hope I have the Tuesday off so uh, maybe a little bit of time for sightseeing who knows but for now uh, let's drive and uh, I hope you guys uh, like uh, the trip see you later a very good morning I uh, slept pretty decently maybe when you look at my face you think otherwise but no, for sleeping next to the highway, it's uh, it's not so bad. And um, yeah, it's quite early still, uh, 6:30, and um, yeah, we can start driving in 45 minutes. And then uh, towards Barcelona, uh, as you can see, also Tetra had the same plan as us. They went until here, slept for the night, and I don't know what time they arrived, but uh, yeah, for sure they're gonna do the same. Uh, you can see all the nice mountains here. And uh, also there in the back, that's where we're going. Uh, that's towards Monaco. And then we go to Nice and then uh, make our way towards, uh, towards Barcelona. So uh, hopefully uh, the weather stays a little bit uh, like this. Not too hot, not too cold and uh, no rain. So let's see uh, what the trip brings.
and here we are so welcome to Barcelona uh, we had a pretty good trip I think we arrived at the truck wash at 6 so we could uh, still wash the trucks park them at the holding area at the racetrack and then my colleague Kuhn picked us up he brought me to the uh, hotel I could take a shower and after that we went uh, for some dinner and then for me it was an early, early bed because I had a long day and I was just tired so anyway like I said today um, uh, we're gonna do some sightseeing here in Barcelona uh, I already been here but yeah the, the city is really nice and uh, also the weather is really beautiful so it's a shame to stay inside and uh, let's uh, do some sightseeing today and well I, uh, I hope you guys like it Okay, we are back at the racetrack. It's uh, Wednesday morning. We're about to park the truck. Yeah, yesterday was really a nice day. Uh, just some relaxing in Barcelona, do some sightseeing, and yeah, Barcelona is such a nice city. So uh, yeah, it was yeah really good to have a day off. And uh, well, today is back to business. Um, now we park and set up a pit box. Try to work on the bikes. Uh, yeah, it's gonna be I think a little bit of a long day just to because yeah it, normally I park on Tuesday so yeah it's a little bit more work but uh, on the plus side uh, a lot of my colleagues come from Barcelona so they're quite early they don't have to take flights first so uh, uh, let's see what the day brings and uh, I'll see you guys later
so here we are the Saturday is done uh, we made it into QP2 so that was nice um, unfortunately only P12 but yeah, let's see what we can do tomorrow and uh, yeah for now uh, it's eight o'clock so uh, we can go straight to the hospitality for some dinner and then tomorrow we go full let's go <laughs> Okay guys, so that's it, uh, no test for us, uh, unfortunately we had a big crash in the race, amazing start, but yeah, yeah, a little bit of a tumble up in uh, the first corner, so we already start packing, and uh, yeah, then it's park the truck, go to the hotel and go home, so, and uh, yeah, thanks again for watching this video. Uh, let me know what you thought in the comments and uh, leave a thumbs up and uh, please uh, subscribe and uh, see you next time. Bye bye.